want to take a moment and visit with you about the importance uh, of being prepared when the situation develops where you may have someone attempting to exercise deadly force against you or another person. Maybe it's directed against a family member. In order to effectively deal with that, there are three things that you've got to have present that day with you. One is you've got to have the right mindset. You've got to have the willingness to do what's necessary to defend your life, to defend another person, and to get it done now. All right. The second thing, you need the skill. You need the skill to be able to utilize the tool that will save your life or the life of another person, which is of greater significance. And third, you need to have the firearm with you. When that day comes, you're probably not going to have an opportunity to run back to the house and get your gun. You're not going to have opportunity to go get your pistol out of the car. You're going to need to have that on your person. And what I'd like for you to be thinking about is uh, this idea that I've been working on. If you're more than two seconds away from your gun, you're kidding yourself if you think that you're prepared to deal with a deadly force threat. People don't make appointments for with us uh, to have a duel like they did 150 years ago. Uh, they, they try and hit us in the parking lot, they try and hit us coming out of a store, they try and hit us in our home, and uh, I'd like for you to consider this, that if you uh, require more than a couple, two or three seconds to get your far, firearm, you're not going to be prepared to deal with that situation. So make sure that you've got the pistol on you. It's present with you. You're never more than a couple of seconds away from your firearm. You combine that with the right mindset and the skill to use this weapon, and it's very possible you'll never have to. But if you do, you'll be prepared.